Welcome back, y'all. So today, y'all, we're going to do uh, how to, so what's going on with the karmic and divine masculine. So, yeah, let's get into it. If you're new to the channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm the Empress. Happy that you're here. If you're returning, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. All right, so let's just jump into it. So let's get some um, messages on what's going on with the Divine Masculine and the Karmic. Okay, somebody love to do stuff for the camera. Somebody love to show out for the camera, in front of the camera. Like, somebody's feeling like somebody is too self-indulgent. Like, all they care about is themselves. They focus on themselves. Okay? Now, we got love stabbed in the back in camera. So, somebody love to show out on, on, on camera. When as soon as somebody click live, or as soon as somebody click um, going on live, or posting something online or whatever when people are looking this person loves to show out and they love to make everything about themselves we got the snake competition enemy clever malicious looking over your shoulder the other women so this is karmic this is the karmic Yeah, somebody seeing somebody that somebody feel like it's time to move on because I feel like this this karmic feel like the masculine is being shady because all he focused on is himself. I feel like she feels like the relationship should have evolved by now. Maybe she found out something because we got the dragonfly, which is being lighthearted, finding out something, things coming to the light. Okay, so maybe something came to the light. This is light bulb going off in her head. She's realized that the masculine you know, it's self-absorbing. So she feel like, look, maybe it's time. Time to move on. We got the boat. Somebody got their eye on somebody else that they like. We got sunglasses and I like you. And Cupid's arrow. Okay, so she's about to mirror masculine. She's mirroring masculine's energy. We got mirror right here. So if masculine want to be self-absorbing, like it's all about him, then she's going to do the same thing. She's now become a mirror of him. I told you, camera is stabbing the back. It's, it's about a show, okay? This is somebody's perception. This is how she perceives this masculine, okay? And like I said, she's getting ready now to stab masculine in the back. We got the golden mirror. I told you, she feels like this masculine is self-absorbed. She feel like he a narcissist and the relationship one-sided. Okay. She feel like it's one-sided. Is there anything else? We got addiction and twin flame. I feel like she is addicted to this masculine. She feels like her and this masculine, um, they co-depend on each other. Somebody love to talk about soulmates and have some. So she might have been doing her research on twin flames and soulmates. Okay. She has this addiction to masculine. But see, we got the Phoenix. That's about to be over with. Like she's losing that momentum that she had for masculine. I feel like she is she has come to the realization that maybe she needed to go do some healing. We got healing heart. Then we got hand of cards. Okay, she's now realizing that she took a chance on masculine. This was a gamble. Maybe it was a risk. So now she's being more strategic on how she going to make her next move. Okay. I feel like she could be conversing with someone else. Could possibly be with friends. Okay. But she's going to wear a mask for right now. She's going to wear a mask for right now around masculine. But the objective is, is that she has realized that how one-sided this masculine is. Okay, so she about to she about to go ahead and and pull a him on him. Okay, she about to pull a him on him. Give me two more cards, spirit. Let's 
soulmates and love call. See, she was calling this masculine in because she thought this her and masculine were soulmates and that they were going to get married. She was being overly nice to this masculine. She was doing all this chasing after him. She was buying him stuff, giving him abundance. She was doing them right in the bedroom. And then she feels like all of a sudden, like, she feels betrayed. She feels stabbed in the back. For like all of that, everything that she did could come possibly come to the end. Somebody's running away from the truth. She feel like masculine always running away from the truth. And she could be bringing things to, to his attention and he run off. Like he act like he don't really want to deal with it. Somebody was hurting some masculine been hurting other people's pictures. She done caught him heart in other people's pictures. So she feels some type of way. She feels betrayed. She feels stabbed in the back. So she finna give him a dose of his own medicine. She about to get his masculine a dose of his medicine. Yeah, she about to, she play two to play that game. She about to give him a dose of his own medicine. So she seems like she already about to cut up. She finna cut up, finna show him whatever you could do, I could do it better. Show me what's going on with this karmic and this masculine. How does this karmic feel about masculine? How does this karmic feel about this masculine? Yeah, she has, she done came to, she done had a wake-up call. She done had a wake-up call. Judgment and the two of wands. All of this been going, this started a long time ago. She, she feel like masculine makeup feel like she got to wait for a serious commitment from him. And she's she's getting to the point where she's having going through a wake up call. She's having an awakening. Ace of Wands, the Hierophant, the Ten of Pentacles, and the Two of Swords. Page of Pentacles and the High Priestess. Ace of Swords, Hermit, Six of Wands, and the Empress. She's having doubts. She's uncertain about something. Yeah, two of swords and then two of wands. She feel like masculine not not ready. She's kind of trying to figure out like, what's up? You not ready? You not ready? What you waiting on? What you waiting on? Mm. She say, huh? She don't feel like masculine ready. She been waiting on some type of answer from him, waiting for some type of clarity from him. Eight of Swords. Yeah, she feels stuck. She feels stuck in a situation that she don't really want to be in. Well, the challenge is the Hierophant. It could be a Taurus. I'm getting Virgo. I'm getting Libra. What's the Hierophant here? Nine of Pentacles. The challenge is if they're going to be in the if they're going to be in a relationship or if she's going to be single. Okay, because she's tired of asking him. She's tired of saying the same thing. She's tired of she's tired of of repeating herself. She got to repeat herself. So she got to that point. She want a new start. She want a new beginning. Why is this Ace of Wands here? Yeah, the Wolf of Orchin.
Why is that well here? The Knight of Wands. She said, if you talk to somebody else, to take your ass over there. If you if you talking to somebody else, you got somebody else that you could talk to, go over there. Because I feel like masculine do a lot of back and forth with her. Yeah. Somebody could be having some money issues, five of swords, and a ten of pentacles. Or the relationship is just it hit a rock hit a, hit a rock a rocky patch. Like it's just rocky. The relationship is rocky. It's too many secrets. Okay, it's too much going on. She's suspicious. I feel like masculine always asking her for money all the time. So she's like suspicious. Why is the high priestess here? She feels like he's keeping secrets, that he's lying about something. He's not telling her that about another person. So she goes spying. She goes looking for evidence. Feel like that's why the relationship not going like it's supposed to because he keeps stepping out now she's looking for evidence she's looking for some clarity i'm hearing then it must be true then because why are you running why are you running off i'm hearing why are you running off if it's if it's is it true or is it not true? So she's questioning him. Yeah. She feels like masculine, um, like he is living a double life. She I'm hearing so it's true, you is living a double life. I'm getting like some type of truth has came out. She's saying, Look, I can't move forward like this. I don't want to move forward. She thinks that it's a waste of time. And see, masculine over here in hermit mode. It's like he's avoiding her, hiding from her. Um, he could be doing some self reflect, some self reflecting right now. King of Wands. Yep, I'm getting he's he's hiding from her, kind of because he don't want to talk about it right now. He don't feel like it's the right time to talk about it right now. He don't want to be looked at as the bad guy in the situation. That's his problem. This masculine don't want to look, be looked at as the bad guy in the situation. He could be used to always being looked at as, you know, everything. He's always wrong. Everything always on him. Okay. So, she is doing her best to try to get his attention. Yeah. She don't realize what, what, what was being said or what he was trying to say. She's reading between some type of lines right now. I'm hearing, well, how come if you told the truth, why she not, why it don't seem like she going for it? If that relationship over, then why it's taking so long for you to come up or for, she, something came to the light, the star and the sun. Well, we got the Empress right here. And the moon. The Empress and the moon. And the five of wands. Damn it. I'm getting some competition. She feel like she in competition. She feel like it's somebody else that he dealing with on the side. And I'm hearing how I'm supposed to feel. You think because you tell the truth that make it that make it seem like it's better, but it's not. That's not how love's supposed to go. That's not how relationship's supposed to go. Yeah, she keeps seeing stuff out of come a bunch of stuff keep popping up out of nowhere. He be talking to people from his past too. I'm seeing that as well too. Um she been looking through his phone. She said, oh, it ain't going to matter because it's going to fall apart. You're going to end up regretting it. The first time, 
the first time you tried that, it ain't go right. It ain't go well. Because you take some things too far. Why is the five of wands here? Yep, nine of swords. She is pissed. Nine of swords. She pissed off. Okay, I'm getting some super duper uh, frustrated frustration here. Frustration. Because the Empress and the Moon is somebody, like, hiding someone, okay? Somebody is being hidden, okay? So, she's super-duper frustrated because now she's in competition. She feels like she has to compete. She don't know uh, the truth. She's trying to find out the truth. Yeah. She's trying to make this other person talk. She's trying to make this other party who she feel like he's dealing with. She's trying to make this person talk. Why is the three of cups here? In the world. I'm hearing this going to end on a bad note. With the world, the five of cups, I'm the five of pentacles, and the, and the four of cups, somebody disappointed. She is upset because he still wants somebody. She done found out that he still wants somebody from his past. She's upset about it. She mad. She's mad. She mad. She mad, 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 mad. I was talking about mad, mad. I'm finna go in the end my feelings there. My feelings. Why is, why is this karmic in her feelings? Why is this karmic in her feelings? Tell me more. Why is this karmic feeling? She feel like, look, we got tears. She's supposed to be feeling, she's, she feels like it's her time to be celebrating. And instead, she over here in tears. She over here in tears. She should be celebrating. We got attached. See, she's attached to him sexually. They have this sexual connection. We got desire. It's a real lusty energy. She 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 believe everything this man tell her. But I feel like this time she's looking for proof. So we got believe in King. She believes whatever this man tells her. They got this attachment. She's super duper attached to him. And it's mainly because of the sex. And she feel like this is her moment. She should be celebrating. And instead she in tears. And she's very emotional. We got upset and emotional. She's super emotional. She's extremely emotional. Extremely emotional. She's emotional right now. She feel like this is supposed to be her time when she's supposed to be happy. She's supposed to be celebrating. Um, but it's like at this point, she can't even get she can't even celebrate right now. She can't even celebrate right now. She don't even it's not a celebrating time. She's upset because he's thinking and dealing with somebody from the past. So yeah. <laughs> Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.